So I'm looking at a couple bags today and I try to find them again and I'm not sure if I want to get. Let me move this cart. Shoot. I'm just going to put this over here real quick. Now, where was it that I was looking first? I missed this. What is this? Oh, Nicole Miller. Um, okay, so, oh, this guess over here. I don't usually get guess, but it's in brand new condition. And it's actually really pretty. Pretty tote. But, you know, I just, I don't think I'm going to get it. Ooh, this is a nice bagolini. Look at that. So this would be considered a large tote or a small carry-on, maybe. Bagolini's a really good brand. I don't know. I don't know. I'm looking more for leather for you guys. Like this. Um, this is a Brighton, but it just doesn't sell quite as well as the leather Brighton, which I still have several at home. Come on, get off of there. Let me just show you like this. I mean, it's really cute and stuff. But, oh, I don't know. Just is not as good as the seller. Even though it's summertime, it makes a good summer bag because it's made of jute. But I did find this coach. It's pretty stinking cute. This coach and then this Michael Kors, vintage Michael Kors. I had this bag. I really regretted selling it. I found it, found it again, and I'm like, I don't know. It's a really nice Michael Kors. Those are the two so far. And then this Brighton is really pretty as well, but there's a lot of wear on the leather, like where the metallic is kind of rubbed off. Now, I know some of you may not mind, but the majority might. So I'm gonna have to pass on that one. I love the color though. $24.99. But the rub on the leather is just not that great. The scratching kind of. What else? Let's see. Grace Adele. Grace Adele. Grace Adele. I'm trying to think. Brand new tags, patent leather. Um, pretty. Excellent condition, new with tags. Maybe, maybe not. I do not know right now. Oh, shoot. Oh, looky here, there's a clip on the floor for me to clip her back on. This little leather clutch, vintage leather clutch. Capizio, you guys remember that name brand? Oh, $6.99 for that one. Why? They always charge. Oh, that's why. Peeling it right there. Nope. Going back. A lot of guests here today. Guests too. See, that's what they price all their guests at. Not a Brighton. Too bad that's not Prada. Bags are scarce right now. Fringy bag, that's cute. Okay, really nothing over here. It's too interesting. Coach, but there's a lot of wear on that one. Maybe a little bit of a short video today because there's not a whole lot of good newly stocked items. Oh, that's a cute backpack. It's faux leather though. It's probably like a Steve Madden or something. Oh, 
the corners are pretty bad shape, so that's not going to happen. I'm just over here talking to myself. Say hi to my, say hi to our friends. <laughs> you know you're on YouTube when I do that, right? Me? No. So yeah. that's my, my camera debut? Yeah, you're on YouTube. Uh, thank you. <laughs> Ladies, if you're in my area, he's the nicest guy and he's single. He'll kill me. He's going to kill me if I know I said that. Single and a great person. Inside and out. Wonderful person. So hit me up below and I'm going to show him. <laughs> freaking kill me. Oh, look at another snake skin, you guys. This is genuine snake, like the one I just, um, like the one I had just had on my sales video. This is, uh, the other one was python. This is just like a, I don't know what this one would be, because I don't know my snakes, but I do know my python. This might be as well. Um, leather interior, vintage. Fancy. Look, you guys, it's got a mirror in it. Oh my gosh, this is so fancy. Oh, dang, who are you? Who are you? I don't know who you are, but you're cute. You're coming home with me. I'll tell you that much. That is so pretty, you guys. I've got a little clasp here. This is so cool. I just love the mirror. Put you back in there. Sorry guys if the camera's all wonky. It's got a suede interior with that logo. I'm gonna have to look it up. This is leather here. And then this comes over and twist locks like that. Ooh, you purdy. You real purdy. Okay, I'm getting that one. That's for the show. What are you? Here's a fake Dooney, and the reason why I know it's fake is because it's plastic. Dooney does not make this style bag in plastic. This one's super cute too, and I just love it, but it's not leather. Looks like a little Kelly, and this color is so hopping right now. Trending very, very high. This is a Tia Neo leather leopard bucket bag, but Terrible, look at that. Terrible, peeling everywhere. Okay, there's another, nope, that's not vintage. It's just a little plastic guy there. Let's see what kind of wallets we have. We have a cute little Paris wallet. I want, to sh I want to try on that little snake bag for you and show you what it looks like when I go over to the mirror. Here's a vintage bag too. I wonder if it's from the same person. It's not leather though. Yeah, it is. Yes, it is. My bad. But oh, I could easily clean it up, but I'm not gonna. <laughs> I'm gonna put it back. I love this one though. Love, love, love. Are you coach? No, you're Samsonite. Sad Harbor. And I'm thinking there's really nothing in the wallets today. So let's go try on this adorable little little here. Oh, just kidding. Look what I just found. This is hot commodity right here because it's no longer made. And I am going to get it for you guys if you want it. Let's see what else up here. I need my ladies to bring out another cart. Okay, let's go over and try on this little cutie patootie purse. Snake skin purse. Okay, 
I have one of these for myself that I use, by the way. So we'll be matching, we'll be twinning. And here is this guy. Okay, hold on a minute. Let, let me get situated here. Look how cute is this bag with my outfit. Isn't that adorable? I love it. So cute. This. Kind of. Why is that bar there anyway? That's kind of weird. Or like this. Ooh, so cute. Okay, so that's coming home with me for shizzle. Okay, upon further inspection, I find this little charm. So it looks like C3. And then in here. It says, where did I just see the little, oh, right here. It says, C3 made in Italy. I'm going to check it out real quick. Okay, friends, so everything I show you that's for sale will be listed below this video. All sales are final. Please know that if you have any questions, you need to ask them before you purchase the item because I do not do any exchanges or returns. Um, I ship only within the US and accept PayPal only. So, so excited to find this little um, leopard silver and black coach with the pretty little sparkles um, in the string. It's just really pretty. Little wristlet, it still has the little hang tag. And inside, let's turn up the air a little bit. It's getting warm in here. Um, it has a little pocket right here. And it's in beautiful new condition. And if you get this, then we are going to be twinning because I have one very similar. And I love it. So cute. So coach, and this is the ocelot print. Okay. I got the Michael Kors. Um, I owned this one in black and gray at one time. It's a beautiful bag. The leather on it is amazing. Tote style. Um, can you guys just see how pretty the leather is? The hardware on it is a very, very, very light gold tone color. Tote style bag. I love all the belted detail on it. Um, I forget what the name of this it's like has something to do with equestrian i think it's called the equestrian maybe would that be it or saddle or something like that i can't remember the name of this style bag but it's gorgeous indeed and then it's, the zip closure is really interesting because you have two separate zippers that go across opens up to a nice wide opening now there was a strap in here but it didn't go it doesn't go with this bag so I just need to clean it out a little bit because there's some little jibbles of paper at the bottom, but it is in beautiful condition with lots and lots of pockets. And then two more pockets on this side, the Michael Kors lining. There's a zipper and they're leather trimmed. Here's the Michael Kors emblem. And then all of the hardware is stamped Michael Kors as well. The leather is so pretty on this bag. Straps are in great shape. Here's the bottom. So beautiful Michael Kors. And then I didn't get that one brown coach bag because it was just way, I was afraid it would be too hard to clean and I was afraid that the leather would bleed onto the fabric by cleaning it so I didn't get that one. But here is this beauty. Real snake skin. Um, I googled this and it does come up as a 60s vintage bag and they are going for up to $200. This particular bag, I didn't look long but I didn't find this exact one. The other ones were usually just like little single strap smaller than this bag. Um, so it's got the vintage hang tag on it. Gold toned hardware. The snake, stra snake skin is here and then the opposite side is a very smooth cream colored leather. 
the hardware is in beautiful condition. It's not even faded whatsoever on here. Little twist lock closure. And then it's kind of like an accordion style. Let me show you. Look how wide it opens up. There's the inside. That is all suede lining. And then the zipper pocket. It's a stiff zipper. Opens up really wide as well. And then inside this zipper pocket is you have this little mirror. Cutest thing I've ever seen. Just needs to be wiped down. So cute. And then you just put the little guy back in there. Zips back up so you can put your lip gloss, lipstick in there, and you have your little mirror. Um, let's see, how does this go? Hold on a minute. I'm trying to figure out. Okay, so the mirror stays on the outside of the pocket. I'll show you once I get it all done. The mirror stays on the outside of the pocket, and then you zip the pocket up, and it goes down like that. Okay, so there's this pocket, the center zip with the zipper and the mirror, and then the front pocket. What do you want to do? Okay. And it's a double strap and I wear, I was wearing it in a store like this. It's really comfortable. So, it is by C3 Italy. Is it Italy, I believe? But look at the corners and everything on this purse. It's so pretty. That's all leather, genuine leather. Beautiful. I love the vintage tag. It's like the Gucci tag. You know how they hang it, the little tag on the inside of the vintage Gucci's? It's like that with the little chain right there. So pretty. And that is it, other than a t-shirt that I got myself with tags still attached. And I paid, what did I pay? $4.99 for it. It's from Ross, but I love it. It's got the Zodiac signs on it. It's all tie-dyed and cute. So, cute little summer tee to wear with little jeans and shorts or whatever. I got that. And that is it, you guys, for today. So, I hope you enjoyed today's video. My favorite was definitely the vintage bag. And I love the Michael Kors. It's a really, really nice purse. So uh, let me know what your favorite was down below. And then I will see you guys on tomorrow's video. Have a great one, everybody. Bye-bye.